ऑब्जेक्ट सो दैट इज अ टॉपिक विच वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस इन दिस सेशन सो लेट मी बिगिन विद टूडे सेशन so guys let me discuss with the very first basic definition of an rename operation so what is rename operation rename operation is nothing but if you want to change the uh, name of an existing object then you have you use the rename operation object can be your table view synonym sequence okay so if you want to change uh, the name of an existing uh, table then you have to use the rename operation okay guys now you can say that uh, you have used that uh, there are few words which is your uh, view synonym sequence all these things then what is this can you explain it so guys be patient uh, this is not right time to understand view synonym sequence and all these things in upcoming videos we will understand all these things right now just concentrate how to rename the table so that's it okay guys in what condition or who can perform the rename operation rename operation can be performed by the db owner or table owner okay in what condition you cannot perform the rename operation or i can say that in what condition you will get the error so let me discuss one by one all that point so if is there any trigger applied on that table then you cannot perform the uh, rename operation if is there any view uh, uh, or i can say that synonym is on that uh, table then you cannot perform the rename operation or, or if is there any foreign key is referring to that table then you cannot perform the uh, rename operation so these are the points you, you need to take care at the time of rename and in these points you cannot perform the rename operation okay guys and let's have a look what all the points you need to take care or you need to be note down in your notes as you can see on the your screen so guys i hope you have understood and you have noted down all that points and let me begin with the my practical example so guys so far we have understood the theory part of an rename operation now it's time for practice so let me begin with my session so let me show you the table which i want to rename it so this is the table which we have created last time however we haven't inserted the data into that but uh, don't worry about that there is no relation between the rename operation and the data so uh, right now over here the intention is to rename the table name okay so that is the intention so for that we do not need any uh, data and we do not need to know about how to insert the data and all these things so and if you are curious about the how to insert a data and all these things then please watch my next video in that i will definitely explain how to insert the data into the table okay so this is uh, all about the table now let me begin with the my original uh, discussion which is rename operation so this is the syntax which we have just seen uh, rename is it's a keyword and this is the table name which uh, we want to rename with uh, which we want to rename so this is the old ta uh, old table name I, or i can say that this is the existing table which we want to rename it to with this uh, name okay new table name and two is a keyword so this is the simple syntax of the rename operation now let me rename it uh, so since it's my this is the my table which i want to rename with the student so let me see so what i will do i will just uh, here do and uh, select and then control enter otherwise you can press over here also so let me check whether this renamed or not so if it is renamed then there is there will not be any table with this name correct 
so let me check whether this table exists or not so you you can see over here we get uh, we got the error over here now let me check with the student name if it is renamed then it has to be with the student name so let me check yes so this is the table uh, renamed and this is how you need to execute the rename operation now guys instead of this table name you can give the view synonym sequence anything any object you can give over here in order to rename your existing name and what you want to rename it the new name which you want to give so this is how you need to execute the rename operation and guys if you like the video then please hit the like button share it and if you want to get the regular update on my channel then don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you so much for watching for the video bye bye take care